smoothly. The beekeeper's job? Yes. Management. Okay. Like how we, uh, like, you know, that how many house? beekeepers are there in Goa? Serious? Maybe 8, 10, 12? Experience. Yeah. Oh, those who are learning. What experience, you mean, experience. Experience 10, 12 will be there. How many we need? See what happens in at least in one one village there should be a beekeeper. I see. Makes in, a big difference, no? Yes. Because what what, what happens is um, if you have this colony, then your yield will increase. Automatically. That's, that's what the government has realized. Yeah. You know, even the scientists, researchers, they have realized that if uh, there is uh, there are pollinators, right? Then uh, the yield increases. Because without chemicals and all yeah, that. Yeah, without chemicals. It is natural. No? Correct. So that's how, how it is. So th these are the two colonies. Actually, I have multiplied this colony. Okay. Multiplied and I keep on multiplying. I see. Earlier, my friends had taken from the government uh, this uh, agriculture. Yeah. And their colonies flew away. Oh. So they were having empty boxes. I see. So I told them, why are you keeping empty boxes? Yeah. Give it to me. I, I see. see that I'll multiply them. Yours didn't fly away? No. What see, made the difference? No, what, what happens is you should know to like, you know, manage them. Yeah. That, that, that is uh, like, you know, you should understand the basics of them. Yeah. Like how they work, what it is, you know, and you have to take care of the colonies. You cannot just uh, keep the colony and forget it. No. Because there is uh, like, you know, sometimes wax moth. That first only you have to remove it. Before it attacks, you have to remove. Which states are doing the best in honey in, honey in, in India? Kerala is also good. Like you know, Kerala, then uh, Karnataka, then in the northern side also they are doing very well, but they are migrating the colonies. And they are, uh, in the north, they rear uh, Apis mellifera. It's a, okay. another different breed. Yeah. So the boxes are also bigger. I see. Okay, and uh, they keep on migrating, like they will have that uh, saso honey, uh, mustard, no? Yeah. Mustard honey. Saso. Saso. Yeah, mustard honey. So uh, during that season, they'll keep a truck, and um, they'll uh, take the bees, the colonies. Yes, colonies. Wow. So what happens in the fields? They uh, they keep the truck. I see. That side. So what happens is they pollinate, they get the more yield. Yeah. So. And the these guys get the flavored honey. Yes. So th that's how it is. Oh, they must be charging also them. I don't know. Okay. Because you can uh, mostly now what uh, some of them they do is if they want a colonist, they charge per day. Because he's increasing his yield. Correct. And government is also. Which countries do well in honey, globally? Globally, America. I see. Yeah, America is uh, they are also. But what happens? Australia is also doing a lot of research. They have taken Apis serena from India because these are Indian bees. Satode musmita. I mean, they make seven combs, like you know, I inside. See. And uh, they have done a lot of research. Whereas we don't do any much research, research on this. Because if anyone tells, like you know, to go under microscopic examination of certain, like you know, the yeah. disease and all, yeah. we don't have any labs over here. So we are stuck. True. So if any problem arises on certain testing, we are stuck. So there was that big fear that bees were dying, no? Na, na, Pandurang Hegde and all were campaigning on it. Because sometimes what happens is it is a chemical sprays, what pesticides. We, pesticides. Because uh, because of that also bees die. Even uh, if they spray this foliar sprays for mango trees, and if the bees go there, they will come and they'll fall down. Wow. In front of the hive. Really? Yes. So some are lost. Those who can come, they are okay. trying to like you know come uh, back some home, oh, but <laughs> they'll knock my off. Because goodness. this has happened with my friend last year. His neighbor spread. Yeah. Where this uh, is? This, this is in Aldona, Kitla. I see. So then he called me. Then he he called me. So I said, did anyone spray the mango trees? Because people are giving for rent. Yeah. So what happens is they are not bothered. They want whatever most of Correct. the mangoes to ripen. ripen, whatever the yield they have to get. But this is a natural way. Amazing, amazing. So that's how it is. You want to see the other two colonies? I have that side also. Uh, so 